But now we find from the Bhagavad Gita the, the, the three words Sanatana, Itana is used there. First thing is this jiva, this living entity, they have been described as Sanatana. Mamai Bhagavad Jiva Bhutta Jiva Loki Sanatana. We are living entity, Sanatana. It is not that we have become jiva bhuta by the influence of maya. We have put ourselves in the influence of maya, therefore we are jiva bhuta. Actually, we are sanatana. Sanatana means itana, uh, nitta, sāsata. Jīvātmā is described, nitta sāsata yāng na hannati hannamāni saviri. That is sanatana. So we are so less intelligent that if I am itāna, sanatana, I have no birth and death. Why I have been put into this tribulation of birth and death? This is called Brahma Jika. But we are not educated. But we should be educated. At least we should take advantage of it. This is a We are Sanatana. And another world is there mentioned in the Bhagavad Gita. Parastasmatu bhava anya bhakta bhakta sanatana. Bhakta bhakta sanatana. This material world is manifested and background of this, this is total material energy, mahatattva, that is not manifested. So bhakti or bhakti. Beyond this, there is another nature, spiritual nature, sanātana, that is called sanātana. Parastasmātu bhāva anya bhakta or bhakti sanātana. And the jīva bhūta sanātana. And in the eleventh chapter, Arjuna describes, Krishna as Sanatana, the three Sanatana. Uh, the three Sanatana. So if you are all Sanatana, there is Sanatana Dham. And Krishna is Sanatana, we are also Sanatana. So when they are combined together, that is called Sanatana Dham. They do not know what is Sanatana. They think that if I dress in a certain way, and if I am born in a certain community, then I will become Sanatana. No, everyone can become sanātana dharma, but they do not know what is the meaning of sanātana. Every living entity is sanātana, and Krishna, God is sanātana, and there is a place where we can meet together, that is sanātana dham. Sanātana dham, sanātana bhakti, sanātana kāma. When it is executed, that is called sanātana dharma. So what is that sanātana dharma? Suppose I return to that sanātana dham, and there is God. Sanatana, and I am Sanatana. So what is our Sanatana activity? Does it mean that when I go to Sanatana Dham, uh, Sanatana Dham, I become God? No, you do not become God, because God is one. He is the Supreme Lord, Master, and we are servant. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Jibir, Sarupai, Nitya, Krishna. So here every one of us we are claiming to become Krishna. But when you return to the Sanatana Dham, then we, unless we are qualified, we cannot go there, then we eternally engage in the service of the Lord. That is Sanatana Dham. So you practice it. The Sanatana Dharma means this bhakti yoga. Uh, because we have forgotten. Everyone is trying to become God. Now practice here. How to become a servant of God. And if you are qualified, actually, that now you are rest assured that you have become a servant of God, that is Bhakti Marga, uh, as Chaitanya Mahaprabhu Gopi Bhattu Padakamalu, Dasu 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 When you are expert in becoming the servant of the servant of the servant of the servant of the Lord, hundred times down, servant. Then you are perfect. But here everyone is trying to become the Supreme Lord. Somebody is misusing the word, so hum, aham brahmasmi, and therefore I am the Supreme. But that is not, these, these are Vedic words. But so hum does not mean I am God. So hum means I am also the same quality. Because Mumai Mahamsa Jiva Bhuta. Jiva is the part and parcel of God, Krishna. So the quality is the same. It's like you take 
a drop of water from the sea. So the chemical composition of the whole water of the sea and a drop of water the same. That is called so or Brahmasana. Not that we misuse these words breathing person and I think falsely that I am God, I have become God. But if you are God, then why become a dog? Does God become dog? No. That is not possible. Because we are minute particles. That is also mentioned in this house. Kishagra Satabhagasya Satabhakalpitasya Jiva Bhaga Sabhikya Sanantaya Kalpata. Our spirit identity is that we are ten thousand parts of the top of the air. It is like a very small, it is divided into ten thousand part and one. That is our identity. Now that small identity is within this body. So where do you find it? You have no such machine. That we say niraka. No, there is akha. But it is so minute and small that it is not possible to see within this material eyes. So we have to see through the version of Veda. Shastra Chakrusha, that is the Vedanta Bhatsa. You have to see through this Shastra, not by these blunt eyes, that is not possible.